I supply the blow up paddle boards and I get a free ride. Stress is getting just a little bit lower. Mine's getting just a little bit closer. Find somebody in my life that can make it for. I'll be found in the broken A way out in the crowd feeling open Find somebody in my life that can make it full So I am about to head out It is 12.50 Wednesday afternoon I'm going to go to the Connecticut airport Fly from there to Detroit And then from Detroit to Los Angeles Where I will be until Saturday I'm going to go to Disney on Friday This is the fit Um, Pretty much just like one of the things that I like to do with traveling, it makes me feel so uncomfortable looking at people in suits in the airport. You know, I kind of want to look good, but I mostly I want to be comfortable. Like I just want to like, you know, sweat shorts and like a loose fitting t-shirt and a hat. I want to smell good. I want to be comfortable. And like, that's pretty much it. I don't want to be walking through with a suit and all that stuff, but I'm going to go with my sister to the airport. Just finished up uh, TSA pre-check for the first time. I didn't know for sure how it was going to work with the global entry card, um, but I was able to just get in the global entry card. I didn't have to take off my shoes. I didn't have to take anything on my laptop or I have my bag. Just went in. So pretty nice being able to have the TSA pre-check and global entry now, which cost me $100. coaching call that I filmed um, and we are going over to Long Beach we're gonna grab an uber woke up did some work did two or three meetings I've got a sales call in five minutes so I'm gonna do it on the way and then we are going to take a, an uber over to Long Beach where I'm gonna meet up with Blake and do some more meetings and coaching calls so I just split up I was walking with my sister and my mom they're over there somewhere and I'm just uh, stopping to do it right here God bless hotspots and God bless MacBooks because they're really small and light and can pretty much just pop up anywhere. Hey, what do you do for a living? Um, have you heard of the brand Nike? Yeah? Uh, yeah, I own that. Pretty sick. Yeah. This might be real, bro. Dude, it's so chill. Not really feeling that coleslaw. Just to give some context here, this was in Hermosa Beach and it looked like there's like a group of rollerbladers at night. So so here we're actually getting dinners. My my friend Rob Chavira and then Blake Saunders, who owns a company called Certified Media. Uh, yeah, we're just getting sushi out here at Disneyland. Out here. <laughs> <laughs> Are you gonna get a butter beer? I'm getting a butter beer. Did it work? Good. 
We are pretty sure that we are gonna get wet. Wet. We're pretty sure we're gonna get wet. We're gonna get wet. We're gonna get wet. So we're going in. We're going into the Matterhorn. It is 5 a.m. right now, and we are in the Minneapolis airport waiting for the next flight. Just landed from LA, got like two hours of sleep on the plane. Um, it's like, in one way, it's very smart timing for a flight, in another way, it's like, really just irritated right now. Getting two hours of sleep on the plane, and having to walk, go to a different place, go try to sleep for an hour, and then go try to sleep for an hour on the plane, and then drive two hours. like some of the worst type of traveling to experience. time it took to go through security with TSA pre-check and the average time to go through security through normal was 45 minutes okay so now clearly I'm getting a beer before it like $18 beer which is just crazy I mean that's New York prices but always got to get a beer before a flight and then I was taking a flight from JFK to Madrid that was an overnight flight and then from there, I took a flight from Madrid to Malaga. And then once I got to Malaga, I was picked up by my girlfriend and her family. And I uh, yeah, to go spend two weeks in Marbella, Spain. Also, one of the things is I flew with Air Europa and the food was okay. It wasn't the best food I ever had, but it wasn't that bad. The only thing is that they lost my luggage and they sent it to France. So as you can see, I'm walking here to find out that my luggage has been lost. It took me two hours. We were delayed two hours, but finally got to the beach here, okay? And then now me, my girlfriend Laura, her sister Blanca, we, we went around Marbella, we went and got some dinner. And yeah, now that starts my European summer journey. And I hope that you really enjoyed this video. Again, if you could, leave a like on the video if you could subscribe in the video that would be super helpful for me and so i can continue to create content like this thank you